How's it going, guys? It's Jay here again, continuing the uh, the quest of Nicolas Cage. In our last episode, we uh we put him in this army exam, and uh, we did leave off one thing, which was that uh, this lady right here, her arm was pointing to the painting, but as you can see, it's been uh it's been covered up. So we're gonna fix that. So what I've done is I've put the uh, the original image back over top with the arm still in it. And so we're going to crop that arm out and then place it over top of our Nicolas Cage image, you know, and then give it give it a nice shadow to to match this shadow that's already on there. So what we're going to do is, um, first of all, we're going to select the pen tool. And why we're going to use the pen tool to mask is because there's a little bit of gray area right in here to where it's all black. And if we use the quick selection tool, it may not be able to differentiate between these two colors right here. So we're just going to go in here and just make a pretty pretty rough mask of where we think her sleeve would be and then just around your hand around the finger and back down the arm until we're off the painting now we're just going to connect it and then right click it to uh, to make a selection and when we do this, I usually generally like to keep the feather radius pretty low, so about 0.3 is good. And then we're going to go up to our quick selection tool and right click on the middle of this. And it is not selected. Hold on. There we go. Now we're going to right click on this and lay via copy. Now we can turn off this original image. And now we just have uh, the hand right here. So I was a little bit sloppy with the, uh, with, her finger, but we can just clean it up real quick. All right, now we're going to go to our effects and drop shadow. And we're going to move the angle to about, you know, to about what we see the angle of the shadow right here being at our arm. And we're going to mess around with the distance and the spread, you know, till we, till we see that shadow matching up with this shadow. So about there is good. And then we're going to drop the opacity to to match that. And then we hit OK. And that's it. That's how, that's how it's done.